Hello everyone and welcome to this video where I'm going to suggest a brand new update or DLC to the developers of Stormworks. Like I've mentioned before, I make these videos with the intention of presenting an idea or a suggestion. It does not mean that I believe this is the best suggestion and that this is something that developers should do. It's just merely a suggestion of what I think is possible for them to do. So with that said, I do want to introduce you to this idea, which is the logging industry. So obviously our modern society heavily depends on wooden products, you know, from tables to all sorts of things, uh, both manufactured and industrial. So wood is a major commodity in the world. That's not arguable, right? But unfortunately there is some sadness with cutting down trees, but likewise, we live in a modern industrial society that requires certain elements and certain things. So here we have it. Now, what my idea is, is to bring to you an idea that has not yet been explored in Stormworks, or not to my knowledge at least. And it is the idea of logging. Now, if you take a look at the map of Stormworks, you see there's a ton of green areas, right? And with that said, if you just do no clipping, right? Lots of trees. Now, do we cut all the trees down? Absolutely not. But what I would think would be cool is that there's some areas that are pre-designed that look just like this, right? They have just trees that are cleared of their branches. So not with the needles and leaves and all that stuff, but just kind of bare logs, right? That are standing upright. And what you would do as the uh, person that comes to collect the trees is you'd have a variety of equipment that you can use and that equipment would help you make money in the industrial sense of cutting down and logging these trees. Now will this fix the problems of Stormworks like the glitches and bugs? Absolutely not. So please don't mention that in the comments oh they should work on this they should work on that. I'm not here to talk about that. I'm here to merely suggest an idea an industrial expansion idea to the existing game. Now there's others that may say, oh, Stormworks is intended for rescue, search and rescue, the Stormworks stuff. But I will counter that by saying that with the addition of the new map and oil industry and mining, that's sort of out of the, you know, far, a far gone conclusion. We've already gone past that. And now you get to choose in this amazing environment that is Sawyer Island exactly what it is you want to do and how you want to do it. And I think that's one of the coolest things about the Stormworks game you're not limited or dictated, oh, you have to go and rescue people. No, you can choose to mine for the coal or mine for oil. So with that said, there would be little areas that have trees all around the map, lots or many, I mean, fewer many that's up for the developers to decide if they decide to pursue this. And it would certainly be bigger than this. Maybe you can get like 200 or 300 trees and you would come and find an area like this. Now, whether there's a base camp or a trailer that is also up for th their own decision, or it could just be a bare trees, and then you'd bring your own trailer and have a place to set up sort of a camp. Kind of, Or it could even be like what we have for the oil rigs down here, where there's a little workbench. But I would actually think that it'd be best to not have the workbench. It would be more like the mining part of the game where you bring your own mining equipment. And part of the thing is the logistics of getting your gear to this remote area. Presumably it would be in a remote area, mountainy area, not near roads. So it would be even more difficult to get your gear there. So whether you'd use a train or a series of trucks, helicopters, your call, right? now. There'd be a few basic ideas of logging here that I could think of. The first one would be they'd have to add sort of a saw that you'd mount on your vehicle. Now that saw you'd be able to mount on a truck or a helicopter. They do have that in real life too. If any of you watch James Bond, the one from the 90s or early 2000s, they were chasing him with a saw. Anyways, not that that matters in the game, but you would have a helicopter with a saw that could come and chop these trees or you'd come with a truck just like this and you'd be able to control it with a remote or whatever, however you decide to build it. This saw would obviously have to rotate um, up or down and also twist because now in the position it is now, you'd only be chopping vertically. 
but this would have to rotate so you could chop the tree horizontally. So that would be something they have to add, and that's pretty much the only thing they'd add other than the physical trees and a location in the map that is your log uh, processing plant or wood mill. Maybe one or more locations, maybe very minimal, like that's um, again up for the developer's idea, but I'd say there should be maybe two of them on either side of the map that you could bring your logs and that's where you'd sell them. So you'd have a truck or helicopter with a saw. And again, I said they would come without leaves, they'd be cleared, but they also maybe should spawn with branches. Not so much like that, but enough that you do have to have a saw that is going up and down vertically and clearing the leaves. And pretty much once the branches get chopped off, they would just fall to the ground and sort of disappear into the ground. So you wouldn't cause a huge amount of lag of things on the ground but they would kind of just fall off and sink into the ground, for lack of a better term. But regardless, that's the little detail. You'd end up with something like this. You'd chop it down with this saw, and then you'd have a truck that picks up the tree or the log. So obviously this is just a winch, but you'd probably have a little grabber arm that has a claw. Now the claw arm could be something that the developers also add as a workshop, a workbench item. Like, it could be almost a magal for trees, right? So once it detects that it is touching a tree, that it'll connect to it. Or you'd use a claw-like system that actually physically grasps it. And so the tree's on the ground. You chopped it with the saw, it's on the ground. You then use the other truck to pick it up. Now, obviously, that could be one and the same truck. You could have one truck with two arms. You could have whatever, a helicopter, a tank. That's where the beauty of the game comes in. You'd make your own logging machines. And lastly, you'd have to transport it to the mill. So for that, we just have a simple trailer and truck. Obviously, you could decide to haul it in a helicopter. You could land a plane and take off with your logs. But you'd pretty much just truck them off to a site that you could sell them. And the selling site would probably just be sort of a place where you park your truck. And the logs would be offloaded into a certain area and that's where they would be sold and pretty much just disappear you'd pl place them into an area and they disappear um so you'd have to have a truck possibly with another grabbing arm that will lift up the log and drop it into this slot or dropping it into a slot and that physically disappears it maybe goes into like a wood chipping mill almost like a, a big chute um, bin that you drop it in so I guess the truck could also have a pivot that just lifts up the logs almost like a dump truck and they slide right into this chute where they're sold and then they disappear and you end up with money in your bank from logging the trees and that gives the game a whole new industry a whole new application of ideas and new creations that you can work because I do love the mining and I do love the oil industry and I think this would kind of just bring in that much more of that kind of heavy industrial work and equipment I'd see all sorts of things and I'd be really excited what people can do with the saws and make sort of chopping robots almost or like at AI controlled little things that can chop the trees maybe even multi um multiple multiple like uh different functions that it would pick it up chop it, pick it up, and throw it into the trailer. Like It's just a three-in-one sort of application that you can apply, and it would get the job done. Again, a very simple add-on, not a very technical add-on in, in the sense of uh, building blocks or new uh, equipment, but it just adds that whole new industry to the game that was not previously there, and something that I think would contribute to sort of creating new creations and adds another whole aspect of the game. Obviously this is very much inspired by the uh, Ice Runner, or Snow Runner, Mud Runner games where you kind of have trucks and trails in remote areas. That could be the next level of the expansion. If it is a DLC, maybe it would actually add sort of small little highway roads up the mountainside. Like I really think that if there was a road, like obviously SnowRunner is a very off-road game with suspension and creeks and physics, so that's not really what Stormworks is in that sense. But imagine if there was a little windy road carving up the side of the mountain 
all the way up there and then here is where you'd log okay so you now have to get all this equipment up the mountain and that would sort of be a constraint that you do in the span of you uh, building something so you couldn't use uh, a train for example you could use a helicopter to get to this spot if there was a logging uh, logging here alternatively there could be places that are next to the um, train tracks so that would obviously be much easier there could be different sized trees that you can get like if they're massive trees say like the douglas fir style trees they'd be maybe in a more remote area or they'd be in an area that you just have to get to but the problem with them would be more so the fact that you'd have to get them to the mill so they'd be huge like massive trees you'd have to somehow put them on a trailer cut chop them down put them on a trailer like they'd be heavy there'd be all sorts of different constraints when it comes to that but that is something that i thought of and i hope you enjoyed the video stay tuned for more stay tuned for more creations i've been working diligently if you join my discord you will find all sorts of leaked creations that i have i am working on a new semi truck just to list a few or list one and otherwise happy stormworksing everyone see you in the next video